Alright, what up, what up, y'all hear that? That's Pokemon! I'm playing Pokemon, but we're gonna be playing Marvel. Figure one out, it'll be fun. We actually got a new little addition to the entire, uh... Well, something new about Pokemon that just happened. I ran into a horde of stuff. Not just, you know, one little dude just chilling, having fun. I ran into a horde of five dudes. That does not sound proper. I ran into... I, they're actually all female, so... It would be okay, except they're all gulpins, which... Yeah, anyway. Um... Like, it would have been cool, except every single one of them is level 5. Like, my dudes on average right now are, like, level 15, 16, around there. My main dude that I'm training up right now, he's level, uh, 20. He actually just got 20 in this fight. So, anyway. I mean, I'm having fun with it. The one thing I am a little bit concerned about... Is that, oh, let's just go ahead and join the first one. What, what I am concerned about thus far, god damn it, is that everybody is saying, like, this is one of the easiest Pokemon games ever made. Which is depressing, because none of the Pokemon games were hard. Like, none of them have ever been difficult in any way, shape, or form. Why can't I not catch this motherfucker? He's level 5. What the hell? Yeah, none of the Pokemon games have ever been hard in any way, shape, or form. And people are all saying, like, this is one of the easiest that they have ever played. Another thing that disappoints me, that actually, like, the first thing that I kind of thought, why have they not, I mean, they've changed stuff up. They've changed up characters. They've changed up, you know, like, you can choose your own gender. You can, you know, like, sometimes you have a male main rival. Sometimes you have a female main rival. Why is it always that you always got a mother and no father? Like, why can't you ever have either both, you know, have two loving parents just because you're incredibly lucky, I guess, or just have a father? But it's always a single mother. And there was only one, I believe I may be incorrect about this, you know, I may be remembering or not remembering, uh, a story about it, but as far as I am aware, the only game where you've ever had a father was in Ruby and Sapphire, when your dad was like the fourth gym leader or something, he was the normal type gym leader. That's the only time that I can remember in Pokemon ever having a father. And it isn't even like, oh hey your father ditched us and abandoned us and i'm a single mother who don't need no man whatsoever to run her life i'm fine on my own but no it's always like just nobody talks about it it's not like oh poor you for not having a daddy it's not like oh you know he's off doing work in like kanto or something you know some other region of pokemon it's always just this dude doesn't exist. You are you are Jesus, and she is Mother Mary. Now, even Jesus, despite the fact that apparently his gave his mother gave birth asexually, even he had a loving father, two loving fathers. So, like, man, how bad is this dude's luck to just never, he never, the main characters never have a father, and nobody ever talks about it. Like, that's just weird to... Oh, I forgot to get rid of Butterfree. I put Butterfree in my party, and I forgot to get rid of him. I mean, I put Caterpie in my party, evolved him to Butterfree, and then forgot to get rid of him. My badsies. Um, but, some, but some things that are good about the game. Number one, I really love the experience share uh, change here, for those of you that may not be aware of it. Basically, it's actually kind of like a mixture of the very, very old, of the red-blue version of the experience share before you were capable of holding items so you couldn't just give it to somebody. And then that one Pokemon would have, you know, get half the experience and the other the active one gets half the experience. Instead of that, um... Sorry. I have to choose my battle options. This is a difficult battle. This dude just did two damage. 
to me. This is a very difficult battle. Y'all don't even know. Um, it actually gives experience to every single Pokemon in your party. You're the main one that's out there fighting gets 100% of the regular experience. And then all the ones that are in your party that don't take part in the fight, they get half. What is happening? They get half of the experience. Which is awesome. Like, that's really cool. Because anything, honestly, that, like, cuts down on grind is phenomenal to me. Like, that is one of the things that... It does have its place in games because some people do enjoy grinding. But some people also don't. And you can turn this off if you do enjoy the grinding. But... I just think, you know, in games like this where people just spend hours upon hours of their lives trying to, like, train the perfect Pokemon, trying to raise, like, five billion of these motherfuckers. Anything that can cut down that time is awesome. And so that's what they did here. And also, any characters that take part in the battle, they actually get 100% of the available experience. Like, it's not even, like... This must be so fun for y'all to watch. Like, I'm barely even watching it. Every time I look up, it is choppier than trying to watch porn on dial-up. Good times, that was. Um. Is this dude actually... Oh. <laughs> and he got hit. But that is an awesome change. Another awesome change... Uh, was the fact that you actually get the running shoes, like, right out of the gate. I know they gave them to you pretty damn fast in black and white. But, like, you used to, like, the old games. You had to wait till, like, a quarter of the way through the game to get the bicycle, and that was it. That was all you had to speed up your stuff. And now I actually just got rollerblades, which technically kind of cool, except for the fact that, A, nobody's used rollerblades since, like, 1992. And secondly, I have to use the stupid circular pad thing and I hate that thing I hate it I don't really have a good particularly good reason for hating it I just don't like it but you have to use that in order to use the rollerblades you can't just like equip them in the menu is this dude just doing hypercharging so he is and it worked best Captain America on the planet best cat not the best Captain America on the planet best Dante on the planet right here bruh Oh, he got poison, my little lion brother, my lit Leo, that is female, and yet has the start of a mane. Figure that one out. I can't. It already confused me, and I already dismissed it as something, as a mystery that I just, my brain cannot solve. But damn it, this motherfucker poisoned me. Why are people poisoning me? That's fucked up. Unnecessary and whatnot. God damn. Damn it, why are you gotta be learning? Actually, I should have learned stuns for. Oh my god, why are you learning everything? Fine, we can learn sleep powder. I forgot I should have taken I should have taken stun spore, but we'll take sleeping powder. And now we got to play. Now our booty's gotta play. I have decided. Hawkeye's not good enough. The problem with Hawkeye, Hawkeye has a very good assist. However, it doesn't really have any hit stun to it either. Like, it doesn't really give me any opportunities for, like, mix-up. Granted, I'm not using it very well, and I'm very well aware of that, that I could be using it a hell of a lot better. But still. Oh, for the love of God. Oh, for the love of Jesus. Yes! Oh, that's fine. Run into the drones. This connection is so fun! But it's okay, because I can mash everything. Shit. I'm gonna do this entire combo. I'm gonna do Frank too. I'm not gonna do Frank. 
Shit! This dude's the best Virgil I've ever played. Shit, I can't block that. Not in this. Oh god, I hit a button and it came out three moves later. Holy shit! Oh my god damn it! Oh god damn it! I'm doing it! <laughs> oh, it's okay. We got a character that can handle the lag. You know, we ain't affected by lag. We should have known, like, we, sh we should have known from just watching the previous match. Why am I still trying to fight wild Pokemon in this route? I have caught everything. Unless there's something, there's like a 1% fucking chance of finding it. But I'm pretty sure I've caught everything. Oops, my, no, my homie still, my homie is still, is still poisoned. I forgot about that. That's my bad. Thank you for giving me so much time to handle this shit. Should we switch to? The other thing, am I playing this? Hell no. Hells to the no. Fuck that bullshit. You are an asshole for trying to make me play that motherfucker again. Hate that dude. I already went this way. I already see like this is the problem with doing this. I'm gonna be absent. My I'm gonna be even more absent-minded than I previously was. Like, did you think that was possible? Nobody thought that shit was possible. Fuck it, let's join this itch. Somebody just commented on one of my videos saying I should have joined. So, hey, we're going to join now. We're going to join now. We're going to show off our skills to the world now. Of course, both of them are using either Dante or Virgil. Why wouldn't they? We're playing online, bro. There ain't no character diversity. Motherfuck. Thank you. Oh, there wasn't even a hidden item there. It was one of those, uh, it was one of those parts where, like, there's all this grass everywhere. This motherfucker have a footprint on his... This dude has a footprint on his chest. This fur fruit legitimately has, a, like, a footprint on his chest. Somebody just step-kicked that dude. But yeah, it was one of those spots where, like, it's just, like, there's a random empty patch of grass. A mint, or an empty patch surrounded by grass, which usually means that there's a hidden item there. But there wasn't. Fucking cock teases. Ooh, I get to battle one of my other one of these homies. There's four fucking like I wanna say rivals. There hasn't been a rival since gold or silver, which is depressing. Because I miss I miss the whole rival thing. Oh damn, yo, that team hyper armor goddamn. Oh come on, Railgun, finish your con. What the fuck? How did you not punish that? Oh come on, don't push block that shit. That hitbox. Really? Really, Marvel? Mm, I hate you so much, Marvel. You just make me mad sometimes. That was some... That was worse than Virgil. Which actually, you know, that makes me mad. This motherfucker is supposed to be a rival. Wants to fight. He has one Pokemon and it's a fucking Corefish? Really? Oh, sweet Jesus. Team Hyper Armor is winning. Oh, sweet Jesus, that didn't even combo. If this dude wins with Ghost Rider, I am just going to lose my shit. Actually, yeah, what the fuck can Hagar do about that? I don't know what the hell Hagar can do about this. This motherfucker. I was born to dance. You're a fat male. You can't dance. You're a fat white male. Jesus. But yeah, in all seriousness, I actually really honestly am kind of like... That's one of the my biggest... 
like beefs with Pokemon is that they have we haven't had a legit rival ever like ever since gold and silver it's been forever since we've had a legit rival now it's all just like the fucking power of friendship and shit with all your you know all the people that you fight alongside all the characters it's just the power of friendship there hasn't been like a really truly like yo these people how did you not see that coming that well that's fine since he done fucked it up please use your x factor please don't die oh my god he did it oh my lord jesus this man is the best fucking oh that better kill oh okay i was looking at the wrong health bar ah, that would have killed him anyway but still this motherfucker is the best damn marvel player i have ever been witness to now oh never mind this isn't the other dude the other dude left me alone I think I'm up after the- oh shit, I'm up now, okay. It's time to get serious now, well let me knock this cadaver the fuck out first. Cadabra knocked the fuck out! Alright, let's do this. Nobody care about smoke screen. Ooh, Bulbasaur! I might be getting Ivy Sword here if I'm remembering my levels correctly. Oh, I'm remembering my levels correctly. We're getting Ivy Sword, son. Ugh. Damn it! What the hell? That makes me mad that that, I don't even know what the hell happened there, but that makes me mad. Should've seen that coming, like that's all this dude's done. What else is Arthur gonna do besides that anyway? Oh, okay, that's a true block stun, alright. Oops, my bad for hitting a button, my bad for hitting a button! Oops! Oh, what the hell? Where was my armor? I ain't even mad about it. I fucked that up. Holy shit, that went through the entire fucking thing? Really? Well, that? Okay. Shoutouts to character inexperience getting us blown the fuck up. I mean, granted, I should have killed Arthur there. Like, there was no reason for me to drop those combos on Arthur. I wish I could blame that on lag, but that was just scrubbiness because I have a scrubby ass sentinel. But whatever, I got Ivysaur, I don't care. But yeah, that was just, that was pure scrubbiness. That was, I got no excuses. I just suck. Should've won that. So it's one of those matches where it's like, man, I, if I didn't suck anymore, I would've won. I would've won no problem, but I do suck now. Where in the hell am I? Oh, I just put myself halfway back across the area. <laughs> God damn it. Shit, now I have to walk all the way back through this damn grass. I might not even get another damn chance to play until this, before this video's over. Shouldn't have lost. 
It's what you get for losing. It's what you get for picking characters you suck with. Oh shit, did I just, did I just, I just, oh, hey, I got a berry, worth it, I just went down, I just grinded down, can I grind back up, motherfucker, I can't grind back up, shit, so speaking of putting myself halfway back across the area, I just did it again, I just did it again, and all for one stupid goddamn berry, He's not the only one that sucks. Like, this dude's dropping X-Factor Wesker combos. <sighs> Youch. Oh, you know another thing that's fucking awesome? There's a fighting-type panda bear. That's awesome. Dude, just gunshot the shit out of him. What is he gonna do? Or do that. Okay, well don't gunshot him from point blank range. Don't teleport Ford. This guy. This guy. I'll turn this up for you now that I don't have the Pokemon sound running. So y'all can actually hear something besides my wonderfully dulcet tones. Don't you stop. Just Ryu players, stop. Like, start spending matches where, like, you, you absolutely fucking cannot, cannot do Air Tatsu. Just, like, ban yourself from doing it. And hopefully you will learn, like, the mysteries of the universe during that time. Because that was... Because mm. all I ever see anybody ever do is, like, with Ryu. Oh, you're picking Ryu? Okay, here comes a bunch of air tatsus. And that's all. Nobody's going to do any fuzzies. Nobody's going to use his actual overhead. Nobody's going to be doing frame traps and nothing. Just air tatsu. Times 20. Over and over. Until either this dude dies or I die. to get to the next damn town so I can stop wasting experience on this stupid Butterfree. I'm not gonna use Butterfree. Butterfree sucks. Oh, I didn't want to grind. Oh, wait, never mind. That's straight across. Okay, we did. We totally wanted to grind. Because we can just go back this time. Couldn't do that before. Oh my god, really? God damn it. God damn it. Oh, uh, it's hilarious to me that he did all that. What the fuck? It was hilarious to me that he had done all that work just to lose Dante to a level three, and then he done fucked that up there. Oh. Well, are you see That was way too... Even I could have told you that shit was way too fucking late. I think that worked. Oh, okay, that does work. I didn't think that had enough hits done to it. Nice. Oh, and he already uses X Factor. Yeah, you're fucked. Please don't try to do anything. Thank you. Please come in, grab. Or just die. That's cool, too. One of these days, I'll see a Wesker do a command grab, and I will just have a heart attack then and there.
Now I have to wonder, there's a different grass type here. Like a different type of grass. And I have to wonder if there's different kinds of Pokemon in here. I mean, I know I'm up next, but this is more important. <laughs> I'm gonna run down the timer because I'm playing Pokemon. How much time we got left? Yo, we're actually gonna see this full match. Shout out to that dude for hopping out of order. Pick the colors, bro. That's the key. That's the key to everything. We gotta pick. Ah, shit. Yeah, there we go. Kind of. Yeah, kind of. Yeah, it's pink, but whatever. My fault. I dashed right into that like an idiot. And now I'm gonna lose Frank. I had no business losing Frank. Never mind, I'm not gonna lose Frank because that does no damage. Oh, last hit. Fuck you. I'm holding back. How the hell? That was, like, legitimately confusing. I was holding back. How the hell did that one hit? Okay. I. Come on! One of these days, I'll be able to actually dash and block instead of just getting fucking blown up for no reason. One of these days, I'll get my armor. Yo, what? What, like, what can I say about that? The homie... He jumps, I have like five fucking seconds to start holding back. I obviously use that five seconds to start holding back. And I get my ass blown up. What can you say? Thank you online for costing me yet another game in your many, many fucking moments of costing me every game I try to play. I love you so much. You're so cool. So let's bail on this because obviously because that shit doesn't feel lacky that shit felt fine but some corny ass shit was happening there that is inexplicable so we outie on that one we gonna try a new one um that was the one we were in i think oh uh, i was gonna join that one uh, we're gonna start our own fucking lobby we're gonna start our own fucking lobby and come back once we have done that